If you're having a hard time keeping your bounding box small, one of the reasons being is that the default key mix, uh, if you have your A and your B and your mask, uh, all three of those are taken into account to build the actual bounding information. So you can see as these come together, we have more information than we would actually need to have calculated. That doesn't really work, does it? Tony Lyons with his Nuke Survival Toolkit has invented a tool called the Key Mix Bounding Box, which does exactly the same thing, except it just takes into account A and B and combines it, and then of course you have your uh, actual mask so that you keep the sizes manageably small on your bounding box. Better? What do you think?